Hi, friends of golfers. Eric Silbert, EJS Golf here, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about sim turf today. This is the turf here. So I got two different pieces of turf back here. I've added the sim turf in to show the difference, and this is just your regular turf you get from you know anywhere for inside here. So sim turf is a great company. I've known for a while. Um, once I started dealing with them, I've gone with nobody else. Um, I found out about them through TrackMan and found out that that is they use them exclusively. PXG uses them exclusively. A um, couple others, EGS Golf uses it exclusively. Um, and there's a reason for it. So company is great. The owner is great. Um, they are custom. They'll do custom work for you. They can do really do anything you want. But above all, like you can have all that stuff is great, right? We need all that stuff in a company. But what I really need is a great product. And that's what I have. So I'm going to just try to show you a little bit of this and why I love it so much and just the feels and differences I get. If I'm over here on this one, and this is what I've been using here and before I switched over there a long time ago, um, is that it just is just like concrete. I don't know if you can tell me hitting off this. It's almost bouncing off this thing. Now, if you watch this thing here, when I kind of go on into it, you see how there's some grab. So to me, that is so much more real. Like if I'm hitting a shot and if somebody's in here taking a lesson, they hit it fat. A lot of times they can hit behind us here and it'll still go through okay. Here, it won't, okay? They'll they'll really get more of a good, um, I would say from TrackMan, my numbers here would be more real of what it is outside because of that. Um, you can kind of just tell from when I do these little shots in here, the difference of just how this reacts here. If I just do a little shot up there, I mean, nothing real hard, but just, Hopefully I didn't freak you out going right over you. <laughs> if I go a little too far left, I'm going to be in trouble. <laughs> so that's just like really hard. Like this is, I feel a little, this is feels like grass because imagine you're walking on grass with your feet, uh, no shoes on. You know how you just feel that little squish? That's what this is. It's very tiny squish. It's not like you feel like yourself go down, but it's like, you know, there's some like padding, like comfort. It's like if I stood on this for eight hours right here, like my back's going to hurt. If I stand on this, I'm going to be okay, all right? Now, hopefully you can see maybe a little bit of the difference as this comes off of here, um, just how it reacts. And, I, you know, the sound tells you a lot, too, just how that sound is immediately. But I'm just going to try to punch one out there again, just like that one. Yeah, so that probably went flying right over there, too. So look like I got it up enough. <laughs> uh, so, like I said, this is the uh, SimTurf product. I love it. I use this. Um, Right after I do this video, I'm putting the other one in here, but I want to show you guys the difference. And in that next video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to put in here. Now, depending on what your layout is, okay, that I, I called the guy at the sim turf and I said, this is what I need. I told them the dimensions and they ship me a piece that is ready to go. All I do is pull this one up, I flop the next one in and I'm done. That's it. Padding's in it. Everything's done. I don't have to do anything. And you see how like seamlessly it fit into here, just absolutely perfect. They laser cut it. And if you have a design you need, here, here's another thing I've done. So at home, I'm gonna show you guys this when this comes in, but with uh, my home bay, where I do a lot of videos out of and stuff, I'm getting a new layout in there of turf. And I just called the guys down there and said, hey, listen, I took a video of the area. I said, this is kind of the size I have. What, what are my options, what can I do? And they came back to me with a couple options, um, well, a few different options of what I can do. And then I asked them, I go, okay, out of all these, like, what is going to be the best if I do a lot of videos here? Because I wanted to try out the new black turf. And they explained it to me why that would be good, why it would be bad. Um, doing filming, not great, but it's going to be great for those who want to have that um, indoor, like, similar bay and want as much dark as they can so you really highlight the screen. So that is when the black turf is like really cool. And it's got a really neat putting section on it too. It's a little different color, but it's it's like a stimp of like 10. Um, so to me, there's like, and also pricing wise, um, what I found overall is yes, you can find cheaper. Okay. I think you can always find cheaper anything from somewhere. The quality is just, it's not there. Okay. This stuff is durable. You're not going to replace it. Um, when you do have to replace it, you don't have to replace the whole thing. You know, you can place the strip if that's what, if you're just focusing on this, you could just replace this if you need to. Um, and I've compared it to others, folks. I've, I've had others. I've been doing this for a lot of years and I fell in love with this stuff when I got it. Like I said, it's a recommendation from TrackMan and I talked to the owner now. I, I, I love their business. I love what they do. 
and get it simturf.com and look forward to my next video coming up where i'm going to actually do my indoor home bay thanks for watching our silver egs golf you're good thanks